This presidential campaign was the first one in which social media played a significant role in uh, the distribution and promotion of messages. Uh, social media had played a big role before in presidential campaigns uh, for fundraising purposes and some for message development, but really this time out uh, played a very significant role. And of course, uh, President-elect Trump, uh, Trump's tweets uh, are continuing to make news. Uh, it looks like he will continue to use social media platforms uh, as he goes forward. I wonder what you think uh, CEOs, really anyone in the C-suite, can learn uh, from the way social media have been used uh, in this campaign that will help make them more effective. Well, clearly, President-elect Trump was able to communicate directly with, with many of his supporters and constituents. And, and that's, um, you know, since the days, I guess, of FDR's fireside chats, when he used radio to communicate directly into people's homes. It's a different venue, but it's a similar, although much more 2016, form of, of communication. But the ramifications, I think, for our clients and for, for businesses are tremendous. Um, you have a way, you have more advanced ways in which to target the audience with whom you want to communicate and to adapt your communications to speak directly to those audiences than ever before. Um, I think for CEOs and other executives in the C-suite, they need to think about the time commitment uh, involved in engaging. So President-elect Trump spends a great deal of his time getting on Twitter. Some CEOs may not feel that that's the most effective or valuable use of their time and maybe want to delegate that to another employee in the organization or someone else who will engage on those social platforms. But there's no question that it's more important than ever before for businesses and organizations to be able to communicate directly with their consumers and, and people who are interested in their goods and services. And they need to think through which channels make the most sense for them. They need to know who is who's, who is talking about them. They need to be you know, monitoring, to be aware of who is, who is talking about their brand, who is sharing news about their brand, and then determine the best ways for their organization to engage in a dialogue, um, not a monologue. It's, uh, social media is very much a conversation. And so how can they get involved in that dialogue and, and share interesting content with the people who are interested in hearing from them.